Nicole Scott here for Netbook News. We're here at CES 2010, and we are at the Intel booth with Sam McDermott. How are you today? I'm great, Nicole. How are you? I'm doing great, and I, I was just jaw dropped by what you have on this screen. Can you tell me exactly what's going on on this amazing looking, just really interactive? <laughs> You nailed it, Nicole. This is called Infoscape, and we developed this specifically for CES. You know, Intel just released our, had our largest product launch in over 20 years. We're showcasing the power behind our Intel 2010 Core i7 processor, but we're also giving people a chance to explore how they might access technology and information in the future. So as you know, we look at ourselves as sponsors of tomorrow, and a big part of that requires us to look at a variety of human factors. How are people looking at information? How are they interacting with it? This has about 500 live links, pulling from about 20,000 different content sources, including Google News, Flickr images, blogs, and tweets about what's happening here at CES, to information, obviously, about our new core processor family. And then we have quotes from people around the world. You know, part of our Sponsors of Tomorrow initiative, we're looking at, what do you want to see? How do you want to see information down the road? So. How is this running? What's the technology behind this? So the technology behind this is really straightforward. We're looking at a double HD display. It's amazing. <laughs> running on a Core i7 processor. And the idea, again, was to really showcase the power behind the processor. One processor, just one. Just one. One. Are you sure? I'm totally <laughs> sure. I know. I know people are amazed by that, but it's absolutely true. Just, again, goes to show how powerful our technology is. And we're always looking ahead. So Intel looks into the future and we like to say the future is here. Wow. Well, Sam, thanks so much for talking about this amazing showpiece here. We're down here at CES 2010 with Sam McDermott at the Intel booth.